I need to stop this clapping, would you? <laughs> okay, hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm bringing you another nighttime routine. Now, I've done one of these videos before, like a few months ago, but now I wanna bring you my updated nighttime routine because baby girl, when I tell you my skin, has improved so much now let me tell you if you go and watch my what is it my gleaming vitamin c clay video you can see in that video that my face is looking tired it's looking dull like you can see my dark marks are really bad like ugh, my skin is looking tired and it is screaming help it is screaming if i scream help yeah that's what my skin was looking like. So I've been changing up my routine and adding things here and there and taking things out. I feel like my skin has gotten a lot better. It's a lot brighter. The texture of my skin is a lot smoother. The only thing that I'm working on now is my dark marks that I have left on like my cheeks and stuff like that. Other than that, in terms of spots and stuff, very minimal because I used to have really bad acne down here on the side of my face. I remember I had like a patch up here and I had burnt my skin from whatever I was using. Listen, it was a mess. So I wanna go through step by step with all the products that I use, so stay tuned. The first thing I use is this Botanics Hot Cloth Balm. Now, this is like a cleansing balm, so you can use this to take your makeup off, but I like to use this to basically get the day's muck off my face. When I tell you this is the this is the goat, oh my god, this this be empty. But I'm gonna use what I have left in here. So I'm gonna scrape this bad boy out. Um, I actually went out today and I actually bought another two of these because they're actually really that good. So this actually like contains rosehip oil which is really good for your skin. So literally all you do is you just massage this into your face. And I like to massage this in for a good 60 seconds just to really get it in there because I feel like oil really brings up the gunk from out of your skin. Do ignore the fact that my face goes red. I have very sensitive skin. So my face loves to turn red when it's touched, massaged, slapped. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> if it's touched or massaged, like it's just, it just goes red because it's really sensitive. I'll use this before washing my face because you know how like soap can be really harsh. Sometimes I use African black soap on my face if when I want a really nice deep clean. And sometimes it can be very drying. So I like to use this before. And then when I wash my face with the African soap, my face still feels moisturized, which is just fantastic. With the cleansing balm, it actually comes with a cloth. So literally dip that in some hot water and then I just let, leave it on my face for about a few seconds and just kind of like steam the oil into my face and then I just wipe it off my face. My face is feeling clean, it's feeling smooth and it's feeling soft and it's just, woo. Okay, so next to wash my face, I go on with the gentle cleansing milk so this is actually from Ren. I just started using this brand and so far I'm really happy with the results of their products. So literally I just take two pumps like that and it just says to massage this in your hands and literally just rub this into your face. And this smells so good. It smells like really florally. So if you like floral smells, you will enjoy this. And the same cloth that I used before I just use the other side of it and I just go in and wipe it off. Okay, so to dry my face, I always take like an oval cotton pad. Next, after I've dried my face and my face is dry, I go in with the Ren Daily AHA Tonic. This is like a light, gentle exfoliant. So I like to use this for the toner. Do a couple of pumps. And then I just go on my face and just really... So once the toner has dried on my face, what I like to go in next with is this user an anti-pigment serum. This is really good for dark marks. I literally take it and pump it on my hand. So it's a dual pump. So one side is clear and one side is like a yellow. So I just take it on my hand and I just mix it in together. And then I just place it onto my face and just rub it in. It's a nice light serum so it literally just melts into the skin really quickly. So you're only allowed to use this once a day because it's really a really strong serum. 
Okay, so once that's all nice and massaged in, I like to go in with Ren's Overnight Glow Cream, which looks like this. Yo, when I tell you, when I, after I wake up in the morning, my face is looking mm, with this. Oh my God, the glow is so nice in the morning. So I literally just take a little bit of this and dab it around my face. And it smells like oranges, like, yeah, it smells so good. It smells so nice. And then I just like to massage that into my face. And yeah, this feels so nice on your face as well. It's really light. It's not a heavy cream. It smells lovely. If you like, like, it's not fruity, but it's like fresh orange. You know what I mean? Like, you know, like a fresh orange. That's what it smells like. So after that, I like to go in with an eye cream. So I like to use the Oli Henry Skin, if I said that right, um, the banana eye cream. And this has really been helping my under eyes. I've got really dark eyes. So again, if you saw the video woo, of the vitamin C and my eyes were looking like, ooh, honey. They were looking like a mess. And ever since using eye cream, they've brightened up a lot in comparison to that video. My face in that video was just really terrible and I was feeling very insecure about my face and how it looked. But now I like to go outside with no makeup on and feel no way about it. Whereas before I would not leave my house at all without wearing makeup. But now, don't care. <laughs> don't care. So after the eye cream and everything's done and everything's set on my face, what I like to go in with after is my trusted health aid vitamin E oil. When I first restarted my skincare routine, I was literally just using African black soap and this. And when I tell you my marks lightened up, my scarring and everything else lightened up, my skin kind of just started glowing a lot more. And I've just been using this ever since. So I kind of like use this as an oil to kind of like set everything else in on my face. I know that sounds weird, but it works for me. Um, you literally don't even need a lot and like it's really thick how it comes out so i don't even use all of that but just to show you how thick it is and a lot of the vitamin e oils that you find in the shops are always like mixed with sunflower seed oil or some type of other oil this is literally just vitamin e oil which i love so it doesn't make me break out or anything like that so i literally just pat it in because it's so thick you can't spread it without roughing up the skin so i literally have to press it in to the skin and like it can leave your face shiny however this is why i like to use it at night time because it will just soak in to my face and then i just like to put some on my lips because why not i've got to keep them moist you know <laughs> yeah so that's what's on my lips as well so as you can see my face is looking very shiny right now so my last step is using my jade roll this is the jade roller that i use now i keep mine in the fridge because oh my god after a long day like rolling this onto your face when it's cold feels so good oh my god and it just helps push the product into your skin and when i tell you like this being cold and your face is stressed like it feels to me it's better than sex like i'm sorry but <laughs> it feels so good so guys this is what my face looks like after my whole routine it's looking glowy it's looking dewy it's looking moisturized it's feeling good and smelling good now literally in comparison to the beginning oh i look like i'm awake now but i'm ready for bed <laughs> So what I'm going to do is I'm going to link all items in the description. Blech. I'm going to link all the items that I used in my video in the description box down below. So you guys can go ahead and check them out. Do let me know down below if you end up purchasing anything. And let me know how it starts working for you. And yeah guys, thank you for watching so much. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. And don't forget to click on that notification bell so you know next time when I post. And follow me on Instagram at shawnee underscore xoxo. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.